Alright everybody, welcome back to a Metroid 2 remake, Metroid 2 The Return of Samus. This is Bro D of the Halidoc Bros, and this is going to be part 4. Uh, in the last episode, I beat one boss and collected the Spring Ball, and then I beat a new form of Metroid, because uh, they evolve as you keep killing them, as you, as you literally hunt them. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, so, I got the very suit in the last episode as well, uh, but that, where I started, right there, that's where the new, that's where, every time you kill all the Metroids, there's an earthquake or, or some kind of sequence, and, uh, yeah, there we go. So, uh, that little spot, there's lava there, but now there is not lava there, and that's why we move on. So, so it's just like that, and I did not see that enemy, I just happened to not get hit by it, but, uh, yeah, so there's lava just like that, and you just go down. Plain and simple. We move on to the next area. So, so a totally new area to me. I've uh, definitely never uh, gone gone to any of these, but it's always good to lean against, jump into spikes. That's uh, that's actually fantastic when you do that as well. But uh, when you lean against the wall in some point, some parts. <laughs> oh, can't speak with the crap. Alright, scanning environment. Sometimes it scans and, uh... Okay, sometimes it comes up. Okay, so there's ten Metroids in this area. Um, so there's some kind of item over here, but there is lava everywhere. So, uh, unless you hug against this wall right here, which, yeah, I'm probably gonna wait, because that looks like it can drain. And also, um, for other... You know, other people know Metroid. Um, sometimes, uh, well, not the very suit, but other suits, you can literally just walk through lava. And, well, I guess that is lava, because I remember in Metroid 3, I was always confused about what liquids hurt me. And uh, I could never really tell, like, what was acid. Like, I could, but I, I couldn't, and I was always, I, I was confused. I knew, you know, once you get hurt, you know, you don't sit in it or anything, but but acid does hurt you, and that, to me, looks like lava. But I have tried to walk through it before, and it still hurts you. So we're not going to we're gonna stay away from that. I'm going to bomb this right here, see if there's... Oh! Well, I'm going to spoil it. You do get super missiles in this game, which, that is quite awesome. So, bomb these over here. Kind of looks kind of like... Could be important. This certainly looks like it could be bombed. Oh, but but now, but why was that there now? Okay. I have no idea what the point of bombing any of that is, but I'll oh, get out of here with that. Okay. Okay, so we need the speed booster. So yeah, there's a there's two items there. Hopefully it doesn't spoil the game or anything, but you definitely get those. And uh, I'm I have to assume I'm getting yeah. I mean, you, know, you, you get items pretty frequently uh, in these you know Metroid games. Man, I almost said Metroidvania, but it's like I'm playing a Metroid game. So there's no reason to call it that, but it's just... Okay, so remember that when we get into this room. Hopefully I'll remember that little corner spot, because it'll probably lead to some missiles, which I still am occasionally running out of missiles. Ooh, Ooh that guy had some guts. Alright, so... I just want to bomb this over here, see if it does anything. Nope. Okay. So that can be broken. That cannot be. And that's super missile. Well, that is... Oh my goodness, I'm terrible. So that uh, pretty much uh, spells out where I'm supposed to go, huh? Because <laughs> there isn't anywhere else I can go. So, ow. Oh. Uh, yeah, the spider ball makes things easy. Uh, this is a nice area to farm things if uh, 
If you happen to run out of missiles like me because you're super reckless with your missiles and you don't care, there's got to be something to bomb or blow up here. There we go. Probably don't need the, uh... Come on. Okay. So, a really big room. Uh, I like, I mean... Oh, what the heck? For some reason, it's not letting me stick to this wall. Oh. Sorry, I, I just like to go the up way first. I know it's boring and slow, but... That's how you find stuff. Especially in this game. That's how you're gonna find things. Crap. I guess I shouldn't be bombing that much. That really isn't that crazy. Okay. Well, you can bomb when you're on the wall because you just have to hold left. And then uh, you'll be fine. But, uh, oh yeah, I got rid of the bottom bar. Uh, some people said it kind of annoyed them. I mean, I think that just getting the content up is important. Uh, and that supersedes... Uh, the fact that I can't, I just can't get rid of the top bar. I tried to blur it out and stuff, but YouTube's, um, YouTube's editing program is pretty much speed up, like, speed up, slow down, cut. It says you can splice, kind of, but I have not been very successful with that feature. So, unfortunately, I just need, um, an editing program or just a better editing program. So there's a new log, so we're going to check that out. Industrial complex. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, like at this point, I mean, I, ha I have played this game. I do not believe I actually beat the game uh, so long ago, but I do not... I don't recognize anything past getting basically the, the spring ball. So, okay, so that whole way was just nonsense because I need a super missile but you never know you know when you're bombing a wall it just a path opens up and whoop de doo doo you know there it goes and I, I got it okay so there's gonna be a lot of bombing going on there but I didn't see a missile crate up here okay so you gotta fall whoa Wow, okay, so I found an energy tank, and so you got to use a missile to get past that. Okay, well, I got five energy tanks, and oh, I'm so lucky that I, that worked. No, 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 just keep going. Hey, and that's how you get those. And then, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. And then I think you can just fall. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so I guess I'm just going to start bombing. Uh, clearly there's probably something much, much more important than that structure. But, uh, I don't know. I'm just going to keep bombing around and... Maybe some more missiles will pop up. Oh, you can just shoot it? Oh, I'm wasting my time. <laughs> okay, well. Uh, well, I guess if I read the comments, I know what I'm going to see. I'm a dummy. I guess, well, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't destroy it all, but I swear I blew up some of it and it disappeared. Well, I don't know. Might as well just look real quick. Yeah, okay, so it doesn't matter anyway. So shoot away. Kind of, it's it's kind of tough on my controller to go to sh shoot directly up and not move, unfortunately. That's why I the one death that I have, I did show it. Um, I think I did. I'm fairly certain I showed it. Yeah, I, did, I had trouble with that one guy. You just point up. You're good. There's a lot of stuff going on in this area, so I don't want to... Oh, 
Okay, so we got another Metroid here in the corner. And I, I went back in one of my videos, and I think it takes 10 missiles to kill these big ones. Jeez. So he took a hundred and... Well, never mind. Doesn't even matter, because I just pretty much got the majority of it back. Okay, well, it doesn't say there's any items here, and that usually means I should just move on. Well, so there's your, um, I think those are called Gamma Metroids, and, uh, you know, I mean, if anybody's basically played any Metroid game, actually, except Metroid 3, I'm not sure what they named the big Metroid, but, I mean, you know, there are, the first Metroids are called Alpha, the that I fought, uh, you know, you can watch that in the, uh, in the, my first video, I go through all the little, um, like the bios, kind of, and those are called Gamma, and there are other ones, and, you know, maybe one called, like, Omega, maybe, those ones are kind of a pain, kind of, so, um, don't ask me why I'm doing this, Oh, here we go. I can actually just get up and then just jump. Jeez, even when I jumped, that was terrible. Oh. What do we got? We got a little, um, Met Tools. That's kind of what it reminds me of. Okay, so this room's interesting. The music changed. There is an item in this room, so yeah, let's destroy all these. I, I don't know if they uncover anything at all. Alright, and uh, to the explorer goes the spoils. So, Alright, and we're definitely going to save it, because I just fought an Omega Metroid, and I still got nine of these... I still got nine of these chumps to go, so... And I well, might as well go to it. Go through it here. Okay. What the? Okay. I'd recommend falling like I did and, uh. Oh my goodness, that was awful. That was just terrible. Gosh darn it. Oh, so he can destroy it too. Well, I didn't realize that. I was just bombing like a, a moron. So basically, I'm just going to stand here and take a bunch of damage because there is a save point right up there, so I don't really have to worry too much. Yeah, they certainly had that guy there to be annoying. <laughs> okay. I don't want to deal with that guy. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't want to. I don't know what that is, but I'm not even walking towards it. Man, it's hardcore, though. It took three charge blasts? Giving up plenty of life. Can't ever have enough life in games. Oh, what the? These things are ridiculous. Right, so let's see, is this something? Yeah, alright. Okay, so you gotta destroy... Alright, alright. Yeah, so I'm certainly getting... I have to be getting one of these items soon, because I'll be running out of... Crap. 
I'm going to be running out of uh, area here to explore. I mean, there's still plenty. I still got plenty to go. supposed to go this way or not there was I mean there are other areas to explore obviously but it's like I'm here now so and I mean if you only needed a red all right so what is it speed boost oh yeah run continuously to begin speed boosting I'll do that after I go in this room. Chozo rooms are always good rooms to... Chozo rooms. Item. Item. Get. Those are good rooms to kind of do this, because you can't bomb, like, a see-through wall, which are going to be, you know, the majority of the secrets that you miss in the game. So. Chomps. Chomps. Oh, and then there's missiles. Ah, crud. Let's destroy this first guy, and then hope Hope I have enough, but uh, hope I got enough room to run. Oh, come on. I don't want to run too fast. No, oh, <laughs> that was a good breaking noise. I like that. Oh, gosh darn it. I just, that's what I didn't want to happen. This room just doesn't look fun. Whoa. Okay, there we go. I'll take it. <laughs> and I'm just gonna ignore these chunks. Uh-oh. Even though I should not have, because there's something right here. But you know what? I gotta get rid of these guys, because I, if you have to do the Shine Spark, which they don't, I don't, know, I don't know if they tell you anything about it or whatnot, but if you played any Metroid, you kind of get how the Shine Spark works. I mean, it is like right, it seems like it's like right up there. I mean, if you see any speed booster ledges. Come on. If you just go up. No, there's nothing. Maybe I do gotta... Oh, gosh darn it. Well, you obviously the exit or something maybe has something to do with it. Okay, so there's that right there. I wonder if I can... If I can shine spark this. Okay, that might be enough room. I have no idea. But then you gotta guess where it is. And I did not do it right. <laughs> you don't have to guess. You have to know. Oh, so it's right by this rock conveniently placed here. You know, you'd think I'm making this harder on myself, but who knows. So you press down, and then you get, you get flashy. And, uh, yeah. That's how that works. Uh, you can go other directions and stuff. I'm going to just ignore those doofuses and... Oh, come on. Yeah, I was I was gonna say oh, this might get kind of tough with this controller because it only reads the analog stick. Oh, that was that was very stupid of me. Yeah, it only reads the analog stick. It doesn't read the D-pad, which to me is just easier to use. We'll do it right next to these spikes so I can. There we go. I'm guessing Metroid. Oh, or 
stupid thing that's just annoying as heck to kill. Okay. I have no idea what that thing is, so... Well, there's a Metroid egg. It's always a sign. There, eat some bombs, chump thingy. Yeah. Alright. Come on. Yeah. You, I knew there wasn't going to be nothing in this room. That just seems too... Too uh, obvious. Alright, well, there he is. Let's, let's just stare at him for a second. Maybe I can just, like, kind of... Kind of... Oh! <laughs> and my shot was spot on, too. Get out of here. Yeah, those guys are just a complete joke at this point. Okay, well, there's certainly an item over there, but... You know, I think it's probably better if I go the other way first and check out that, that other area because I don't want to have to, like, shine spark and come back and blah, 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 and... Yep, just rolling. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. And uh, to avoid that problem I was just talking about... Oh, come on! doesn't like to grab very much when you use the spring ball, but who knows? It's probably just a, like an item or something. Right, so I don't want to deal with this bozo. There's clearly something going on in this room. Okay, right there. I haven't seen any extra pathways light up yet, so that's the exit. Those those floors are really tricky. They get you. You'll, you'll see an item. There's a good spot in Metroid 3 where they put a energy tank right out in front of you. And you're just like, whoop de doo casually walking, and you fall through the floor, and it completely sucks. Because it's actually the part where they sort of show you how to do the um, the wall jump technique, which I actually haven't tried in this game, but that's well, it's kind of working. Um, I was never very good at that, and as a kid, it was so incredibly hard. I So, I don't think I got that energy tank as a kid, because it took me forever to, like, get to get it down, you know, and uh, once I finally got through it, I, I wanted to explore the rest of the game so bad that, you know, I just didn't care about an energy tank, which, I mean, you get pretty uh, overpowered in that game anyway, but, you know, I think I just saw super missiles, and everybody likes super missiles. What the heck is going on? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Too many things going on. Oh, luckily there's a save point there. You know what? I just don't care. Just gonna walk past all you chumps. I know there's items and stuff in there, but... I mean, I probably shouldn't just stand there, but I just... <sighs> Those guys are the worst. Oh, this... I didn't like the other one. No. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I would... Probably should jump a little bit there. I don't know why I wasn't. I was just being, like, really stupid and stubborn. Okay. Um... Controls. Hold, jump, three, grab. Okay, so I think grab would be this button. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. 
That is a super missile. The fabled super missile. Um, are you serious? Oh, I, I, I have like, no idea. Seriously? Oh, that is all I was supposed to do. Oh, oh, BS. Okay, so what is this? The super missile pit? What? And so that was that I just break that little area and then. Oh, come on! Well, duh, if I would have known that. So, is it gonna give me a second one or do I have to exit the room? Okay, well, it seems like it's being fair. I don't, I don't know why Super, or Super, I don't know why Super Metroid, I mean Samus, I don't know why Samus just can't like pick that up. Bazing, alright, so the other one should be busted, right, okay, we gotta go through the crusher thingy, oh, ah. I don't mean to keep doing that, it's just, it's just the analog stick, it's just, oh no. And once again, this the analog stick, it's just really um It's really finicky is, is what I'm trying to say. I'm sorry, I trailed there for a second. It's just really, really like finicky. I think there actually is a way to tone it down in the options, and I might check that out. Cause being finicky is hard. Makes it, it does make it a little difficult. But I pretty much just left. Uh, oh yes, yeah, so you want to just jump a little there. And uh, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you basically, as you can see, he it's he like this robot. It's like, you know, it can get a higher jump the lower you are to the ground. You just hold A to jump. So, when you get under that, you just hop, hop, and hop. I'm just going to take my chances. Hey, it worked. Let's... <laughs> I almost... It's like, I almost think I should just be the robot again. Because it's like... Everything's good, everything's good. Get a little careless, I don't have much life left. Well, you know there's gonna be a Metroid down here somewhere. So hopefully... Ugh. Yeah, these crystals you can't break through. I think uh, I encountered them. Ooh, man. So whatever it is, well, it's super missiles, obviously, duh. Five times damage. Um, that is a little vague. Is it five? What is it five times the damage of my laser? Uh, my regular missiles? Uh, I don't know, but it don't matter because I got them. And, uh, and Metroids can break out of stuff, so let's let's wait here a second. Let's see. Nothing. No, it just looked like a. Just look like a hallway that a Metroid would be waiting, waiting to eat my brains. Oh, I know Metroids don't do that, but okay. So I'm just gonna pause the game here and just kind of, yeah. That looks like that looks like about what it should. Oh, look at that! Made it through like a ham. Didn't even get touched. And actually, speaking of that. Okay. There's a lot of. Cr I don't. Uh, I don't believe I have the uh, enough energy to do well here. So I'm going. I'm. I'm checking it out and going to the save point. Well, as soon as I check, I'll get away from me. As soon as I check out this area here... Okay, so it's right there. I don't want to, like... 
Oh, okay, so it's just... So that's just, I guess, like a quicker way to get back up. So, it's there. And uh, the save room's right here. Voila! Okay, so we're charged up, ready to go. We got super missiles and speed booster, which is mighty okay with me. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna call it here. So... Uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time.